is about doing, 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 and doing. So I'll see you in a second. What is up, ladies and gentlemen? We are back. So, this is gonna be a tough one. We've got a very tough task ahead of us. I have 60 days just under to try and get in shape to run a sub three hour marathon. So we don't have a marathon race, obviously, because they're all canceled, but we're putting on our own little marathon around one of the parks in London. And it is for an amazing cause. One of my friends, he, um, his son was really ill, like terminally ill when he was born. Um, and he was at Great Ormond Street Hospital and they saved his life. And just to thank the nurses and doctors that saved his son's life and all the great work they do, he is raising money for Great Ormond Street just to say thank you for giving his son back to them and giving him a life. And it's just been absolutely amazing. Me and the dog are out walking. So I am now in training because I committed to this a while ago when I was training and I was in good shape and it was all fine. Um, but obviously I've not been training and running. I've had my calf issues. I've had my mental issues and I sort of fell off the wagon a bit, but now we are back. Um, I have run 20 minutes this morning, uh, two and a half miles at 7.30 mile in, which was a struggle. I'll put that up like here, here's the Strava bit of it. Um, I'm gonna go out again this evening. I need to get cross training. And this whole two months is gonna be me just vlogging about trying to get fit enough to run this sub three hour marathon. So please follow along, enjoy. The rest of the day will continue after this announcement or opening, whatever this is. Um, and yes, this is going to be very very tough because i am quite overweight and i've drank a lot of beer a lot of pizza and just not ran properly strained my calf twice in the last two months trying to get out and get back training um so i'll see you all in a sec all right so i'm back for walking with the dog we need to make a plan about how we're going to attack this it's time for a coffee in my absolutely amazing running punks mug thanks jimmy um but i think i need a bacon sandwich to get myself started so that's just in the oven cooking and a bit of cheese brown bread so sort of healthy but I know what you're thinking that's not going to help me lose weight but we'll get there we'll get there however we need to decide on what kind of sessions what kind of running how I'm going to avoid injury and all the different kinds of things that we need to do so we will lightly touch on it with a coffee in a second I'll see you in a sec so bacon sandwich demolished back on the coffee and um, sorry I'm a slurper so apologies I, I might need to cut the sound out now because it is disgusting so we need to just think about this. So I don't want to overdo it, but I need to train a lot in a short space of time. So I'm thinking today, I've already ran two miles this morning. I'm going to go out and do a few miles later on and see how that goes. And then, sorry, look at this wet dog just sitting on me. Oh baby, you're so wet for my walk. So I'm going to go do a really light and breezy run, just in case I had toast in my teeth and we're just gonna chill. Then we're gonna figure out what we're gonna to do tomorrow. So today is very simple. The whole week is gonna be really simple. This whole week, it's just about getting back on the bike, getting out, making sure I have no calf strain or any sort of issue with my right calf throughout the whole week. And now I've said that, I probably won't stop thinking about it. However, that's the goal. So I'll catch you all later when I go out for a run. I'm gonna carry on drinking my coffee. The sandwich has been demolished, hence why the dog is now sitting on me, hoping he can get some, but there's none left. Sorry, baby and he looks like a drum rat. Anyway, I'm off to do some more work, back in my cupboard, and I'll see you all in a bit. All right, we're fully ready, and we're about to go out and try a little jog. We've done a run this morning. This one is supposed to be even slower and more relaxed. So I'll see you out there. You know that I'm the queen of overthinking. It's like we're done before we even started. So if this is the end now, baby, you know that I gave him my all. I believe in us. I won't give up on you. I will be holding on for life. Hope you believe in us. Please don't give up on me. At least give me a try. Cause you're the best thing, the best thing. You're the best thing that... <sighs> What is up, beautiful people? So, we're out for the second run. We're just taking it easy, doing a bit of filming, just jogging, taking it nice and light. We'll probably end up being about three miles, just under. And I'm feeling good. My feet are sore, but I think that's because I've tied my shoes too tight. So I'm gonna untie them a little bit and see if that helps. But otherwise, body feels good. I'm running really easy. And the whole goal of this week is simple, easy running. 
and then we're going to start focusing on how to run this sub three hour marathon this week is about doing 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 and doing so i'll see you in a second two runs done one just under three miles and one just over two so five and a bit miles for the day at 7 30 pace obviously the second one was a bit slow there's like a 9 40 in there while i was doing some filming but other than that good running i'm gonna leave it there today i feel good and i will see you all tomorrow